Discover the extraordinary journey of Jungkook, the dynamic force behind BTS in this captivating documentary. Unveiling the untold struggles, resilience, and unyielding passion that have shaped him into a global icon, witness the true essence of BTS Jungkook in a story that transcends borders, unites hearts, and celebrates the power of music. Jungkook was born in 1997 on September 1st in the city of Busan, which is located in South Korea. Jungkook wanted to become a badminton player, but one day he was watching a television in which he saw G-Dragons performing Heartbreaker, which captivated Jungkook. This experience lit a spark of passion inside Jungkook to become a singer and lead to the path of the music world. In 2011, Jungkook took a shot at stardom by auditioning for the South Korean talent show Superstar K. Although he wasn't selected, his talent caught the attention of seven entertainment companies, and he ultimately chose to join Big Hit Entertainment, where he would later meet RM, a fellow BTS member and leader. To prepare for his debut, Jungkook dedicated himself to refining his dance skills. He traveled to Los Angeles in the summer of 2012 for dance training under Movement Lifestyle. His journey to stardom started with appearances in Joe Kwan I'm Da One music video and working as a backup dancer for Glam before finally debuting with BTS. Despite his dedication to his craft, Jung Kook managed to prioritize his education. He successfully completed his studies at the School of Performing Arts Seoul. In a bold and unconventional move, he made the decision to forego taking the CSATs, which is the nationwide university entrance exam in Korea. Instead of pursuing the traditional path, Jungkook focused on pursuing his passion for music and performing, a choice that has undoubtedly played a significant role in his journey with BTS. Even amidst his demanding schedule as an international superstar, Jungkook remained committed to his academic goals. Impressively, he completed his studies and earned his degree from the Department of Broadcasting and Entertainment at Global Cyber University in March 2022. His outstanding accomplishments were duly acknowledged, and he received the prestigious President's Award, a true testament to his unwavering dedication and undeniable talent. Jungkook's ability to balance his thriving music career with academic excellence is truly commendable and serves as an inspiration to many. On June 12, 2013, Jungkook marked his debut as a member of BTS with the release of the single Too Cool For School. Throughout his journey with BTS, he has also showcased his talent through three remarkable solo songs. The first, titled Begin, is a captivating pop track from the 2016 album Wings. It beautifully narrates his experiences of moving to Seoul at a young age to pursue his dream of becoming an idol, expressing heartfelt gratitude to his bandmates for their unwavering support during that time. The second solo track, Euphoria, a future bass song, accompanied a nine-minute short film released on April 5, 2018, as part of BTS' Love Yourself series. Produced by DJ Swivel, the song earned significant recognition by charting at number five on the billboard bubbling under Hot 100. Its full studio version was later included in BTS' Love Yourself Answer compilation album, released on August 24. The third solo song, My Time, is an emotionally charged R&B track from the band's 2020 studio album, Map of the Soul 7. It delves into the sacrifices made during his journey as an artist, reflecting on the trade-offs of foregoing typical teenage experiences due to his career. Notably, both Euphoria and My Time achieved remarkable milestones by becoming the first and second longest charting solo tracks among K-pop singers on the Billboard World Digital Song Sales chart, spending an impressive 90 and 85 weeks on the ranking, respectively. In addition to his singing prowess, Jungkook also proved his skills as a producer, contributing to two BTS songs. He played a significant role in crafting Love Is Not Over from the band's 2015 EP The Most Beautiful Moment in Life, Part 1, as well as Magic Shop from the 2018 album Love Yourself, Tear. For both tracks, he is credited as the main producer, showcasing his versatility and creative input within the group's music. In October 2018, Jungkook, along with his bandmates, received the prestigious fifth-class Hwagwon Order of Cultural Merit from South Korea's president Moon Jae-in, recognizing their significant contributions to culture and the arts. Subsequently, in July 2021, they were appointed as special presidential envoys for future generations and culture by President Moon, entrusting them with the responsibility to champion global agendas for future generations and enhance South Korea's diplomatic efforts and international standing. 
This recognition underscores Jungkook's role not only as a talented artist, but also as a positive influence on the world stage. In September 2015, Jungkook took part in the meaningful One Dream One Korea campaign, where he collaborated with several Korean artists on a touching song dedicated to the memory of the Korean War. The song was officially released on September 24th and was later showcased at the 1K concert held in Seoul on October 15th. The following year, he made his entry into the entertainment industry by appearing in the pilot episode of Flower Crew. He also left a lasting impression with his appearances on Celebrity Bromance and even participated in the popular show King of Mask Singer, competing under the intriguing alias Fencing Man in episode 72. On November 6, 2018, Jungkook had a special musical moment when he collaborated with American singer Charlie Puth. They performed a delightful duet of Charlie Puth's We Don't Talk Anymore at the MBC Plus X Genie Music Awards. Jungkook's diverse talents extended to music production as well, as he gifted fans with the self-produced song Still With You on SoundCloud as part of BTS annual debut anniversary celebrations on June 4, 2020. In February 2022, Jungkook once again wowed fans with his soulful vocals as he lent his voice to the soundtrack of Seven Fates, Chaco, a webtoon based on BTS. The song, titled Stay Alive, was produced by his bandmate Suga and created quite a splash, becoming Jungkook's first solo entry on the Billboard Hot 100. It made its debut at number 95, an impressive achievement. Moreover, Stay Alive also marked Jungkook's first solo top 10 entry on the Billboard Global XCL. U.S. chart, securing the eighth spot. What's more, it made history as the first Korean soundtrack to debut on the UK official singles chart, landing at number 89. The song's success truly showcased Jungkook's immense talent and global appeal. In the ever-changing symphony of Jungkook's musical journey, he continues to enthrall and captivate fans with each new endeavor. Commemorating BTS's momentous ninth anniversary on June 12, he unfurled the ethereal masterpiece My You, a self-produced gem that resonated deeply with listeners. But the mystique didn't end there. His boundless creativity knew no bounds. Collaborating with the mesmerizing Puth, Jungkook astounded the world with left and right, a harmonious fusion of their talents that left hearts aflutter. Yet the crescendo of Jungkook's accomplishments was orchestrated on November 20th, a date forever etched in history. Dreamers, the illustrious single he unveiled, earned him a cherished place in the spotlight at the grandiose opening ceremony of the 2022 FIFA World Cup in Qatar. Together with the mellifluous Qatari singer Fahad al kubaisi he authored an unprecedented melody, the first-ever official World Cup theme song sung by a Korean artist at the esteemed opening ceremony. A transcendent moment, eternally cherished by Jungkook and his fervent devotees, reverberating through the corridors of time. March 2023 saw Jungkook stepping into the role of global ambassador for Calvin Klein, adding another feather to his cap. His earlier self-produced songs, Still With You and My You, were officially released on streaming platforms worldwide as singles under his name on July 3rd. The excitement continued to build with his debut solo single Seven, featuring American rapper Lato, which was released on July 14th, solidifying Jungkook's position as a multifaceted artist with an ever-growing global impact. Jungkook, as described by Rolling Stone's Brian Hyatt, possesses an extraordinary soulful tenor. According to Kim Min-suk from Reputation, his voice is soft and perfectly suited for sentimental songs, and he impressively maintains stable intonation even while dancing. Mary Soroki of Consequence notes that Jungkook's clear and dexterous voice is tailor-made for pop music, Music critic Kim Young Day highlights Jungkook's vocal prowess in BTS songs like Danger, Butterfly, Autumn Leaves, and Lost, as well as in his solo track Euphoria, praising his expressive capacity that adds depth to ordinary notes. In a recent honor, Rolling Stone listed Jungkook among the 200 greatest singers of all time, acknowledging him as an extremely gifted singer who effortlessly hits high notes and harmonizes flawlessly with his BTS bandmates delighting audiences with ad-libs and unexpected vocal riffs that keep things interesting. Jungkook finds musical inspiration from a diverse set of artists, including Justin Bieber, Justin Timberlake, and Usher, as he mentioned in various interviews and conversations. These iconic musicians have left a significant impact on him, shaping his artistic journey and contributing to the unique style he brings to BTS's music.
In the 2019 Gallup Korea survey, Jungkook's celestial charisma illuminated South Korea, propelling him to the esteemed third place among the most adored celebrities. An enigmatic star, his journey to stardom began humbly at the 20th spot in 2016, but like a phoenix, he ascended to 17th in 2017 and soared to 8th in 2018. One could hardly deny the enchantment he cast on China's entertainment realm, reigning as the unchallenged favorite for an astounding 10 consecutive weeks on High China's cherished list of adored celebrities in 2018. His appeal transcended borders, binding hearts across the world. Beyond his musical prowess, Jungkook's luminous influence serves as a constellation of guidance for artists like Kim Dong-han and Hyung Seop X Yui Wung, who find their inspiration and path illuminated by his radiant star. The young K-pop sensation's online presence is equally remarkable, as he dominated Google's searches for male K-pop idols in the first half of 2019 and continued to reign in the following year. Moreover, he earned the title of the most searched K-pop idol on YouTube in both 2019 and 2020, demonstrating his widespread global impact. On social media, Jungkook's tweets became a sensation, becoming the most retweeted in South Korea in 2018 and globally in 2019. Even in 2020, he secured the second most retweeted position worldwide. Not to mention, he set awe-inspiring records for the most real-time livestream viewers in VLive history. With an astounding 3.7 million viewers in October 2018 and a mind-boggling 22 million in March 2021. Beyond his musical prowess, Jungkook has earned the endearing moniker of the sold-out king due to the incredible demand for products he is associated with, whether it's shoes, fabric softener, wine, or even novels that he recommends. His impact extends to fashion trends as well, notably sparking a modern hanbok craze in the Korean entertainment industry after he was spotted wearing it, leading several celebrities to follow suit. Jungkook's influence has even reached the political realm, with his photos being used by a lawmaker to promote the legalization of tattoos in South Korea in 2021. While this garnered mixed reactions from netizens, it exemplifies the profound impact Jungkook has on various aspects of society. Additionally, his image was leveraged by Mayor John Giesnell Yap of Tagbalar in Philippines to encourage citizens to receive the COVID-19 vaccine, emphasizing his role as a symbol of hope and unity during challenging times. Jungkook's success in the entertainment industry has certainly paid off, as his net worth was estimated to be around 20 million US dollars as of July 2021. It's clear that his talent, hard work, and love from fans have contributed to his impressive financial achievements. In 2017, during a concert in Chile, Jungkook unfortunately collapsed. The incident was quite concerning for fans. Then in 2018, he faced a heel injury during the Love Yourself World Tour, which affected his ability to participate fully in choreography. Despite this setback, he showed his dedication by continuing to sing while seated during some parts of the European leg of the tour. Moving on to November 2019, Jungkook was involved in a car accident with a taxi, but thankfully both parties involved didn't suffer any major injuries. They managed to reach an amicable settlement. Since 2018, Jungkook has been residing in Hanam Dong, Seoul, along with his fellow bandmates. He seems to be enjoying his life in South Korea's bustling capital. In July 2019, he made headlines when he purchased a luxurious apartment in Yongsan District, Seoul, worth a staggering 4 billion won. Interestingly, he later surprised his older brother by gifting him the apartment in December 2020, showcasing his affectionate nature. On April 14, 2023, Jungkook showed his incredible generosity by making a heartfelt donation of 1 billion won, equivalent to 874,164 US dollars 8 cents, to the Seoul National University Children's Hospital. His donation is specifically aimed at helping cover the treatment expenses of patients from low-income families, as well as supporting the hospital's integrated care center. This act of kindness reflects Jungkook's compassion and commitment to making a positive impact on the lives of those in need. Thank you for watching. I hope you like this documentary. Have a great day.